Alex, you exist on YouTube! Oh my god, um, hi everyone. I was super excited to see your video, I was not expecting it. It was like, you died in January, and then you came back to life in April. I mean, Jesus did do better, he did just take a break for one day, but you're back. Oh my god, I cannot even explain the amount of excitement here. I may have noticed that my vlog every other day in April has gone to shit. There's a great story behind that that I think I'm going to tell. On Tuesday when I was supposed to post my last vlog, there was the Think Fast. And the Think Fast is a 24 hour fast that it has like a dual purpose. One is to be in solidarity with the poor, uh, those who are hungry, and the other one is to go on a spiritual journey. So I wake up Tuesday with a tickle in my throat and I'm like, ah, whatever, no big deal, I'll be fine. And then I fasted all day. I fasted from 11 o'clock at night on Monday until 11 o'clock at night on Tuesday. Oh my god. The fast was really eye-opening. Seeing what people struggled through when they're hungry, we came to the conclusion that after about 20 hours, you feel drunk, quite literally drunk. You're intoxicated with hunger, which isn't easy. You have trouble focusing, you have really low energy, and you generally don't feel well. I took it to another level. Because I was sick and I fasted, I was quite literally suffering. I had the flu, and I also pinched a nerve in my back, and I was not eating. I had shooting pains up and down my leg. Like, I was in tears. It hurt so much, and it was just a kind of suffering that... I've never had to endure before. It was really, really tough. I had a hard time just keeping myself together because my body hurt so much. At about 10 o'clock, so for the last hour of the fast, um, a friend and I did the Station of the Cross. We presented them, and what we did was we paired them up with social justice issues. For things like Jesus is laid in the tomb, it was connected with all those who had to lay children to rest before their time. It was a very moving hour of connecting the cross to our current struggles, and while I am Catholic, I'm not superbly religious. It's still kind of a front that I'm trying to work out, but I do love spiritual journeys because I think everyone has a spirit and something that has to be furthered, and I do believe that religions teach a fundamental truth. But it was a beautiful, beautiful presentation that I was physically dying during, like, I don't know, I can't even express the kind of pain I was in as I did this. I got home and I had some food and I went to bed and for two days I lay in bed delirious. It kind of turned on the switch that people don't just die from starvation, they, they die because they're hungry and they get the flu. And while the flu is something we all have no problem living through, if I had not eaten for another 12, 13 hours, I would have had to been hospitalized. Food is something we take for granted and we don't realize the full impact of how much it does help us out and how important it really is to us. It's not just being comfortable and being full. It helps us fight off diseases. It helps us stay functioning. It is just a real eye-opener that hunger isn't on its own. You're not just hungry and that's not just it. There are so many side effects to hunger that are ridiculous and it's not just a growling tummy. The other thing is we had lots of water. It was like the rule of the day was drink water. But in reality, places where people go hungry, there most likely is not a source of clean water. Food and water are things I think we take for granted. If anyone has an opportunity to partake in either 30 hour fast, think fast, or you feel like fasting on your own, I strongly encourage it. You do grow very much spiritually as a person. I became in touch with my inner self and it hurt really bad. And the fact of the matter is I still don't have enough strength to go out for a full day. I I'd collapse. Have a great Easter weekend if you celebrate Easter. If not, enjoy copious amounts of chocolates that are available at Walmart.